We who with songs beguile your pilgrimage and swear that beauty lives, the lilies die. We poets of the proud old lineage who sing to find your hearts, we know not why. What shall we tell you? Tales, marvelous tales of ships and stars and isles where good men rest, where never yet the rose of sunset pales and winds and shadows fall into the west. And there the world's first huge white-bearded kings in dim glades sleeping, murmur in their sleep, and winding round their breast the ivy clings, cutting its pathway slow and red and deep. And how beguile you? Death has no repose as warm and deep as the desert sand that hides the beauty and bright faith of those who make the golden journey to Samarkand. And now they wait and whiten peaceably, those kings, those poets, those so fair. They know time comes. Not only you and I, but the whole world will whiten here and there, when those great caravans that cross the plain with dauntless feet and sound of silver bells put forth no more for beauty or for gain, take no more solace from the palm-girt wells. When that great market by the sea shuts fast, all that long Sunday that goes on and on, when even lovers find their peace at last, and earth is but a star that once it shone. Is there anyone who's never dreamed of vanished age of knights and kings, when magic danced upon the wind, chanters flew on dragons' wings, Seed grew in the hearts of men, the first bright flower of chivalry. When past and present were as one, reaching for infinity. And in this cold computer age, we fear the future, scorn the past, stumble on from day to day. Nothing seems to last. What can't be proved, can't be believed. Legends are lies to be dismissed. Excalibur rusts in its sheath, and Camelot did not exist. So, lady, will you go with me? We'll leave this barren world behind. It has no place for such as we. Out of fashion, out of time. If you will be my Guinevere, I try to be your Lancelot. Through storms and shadows, we will steer and come at last to Camelot. Thank you very much.